हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज समीर एंड यू आर वाचिंग मंस मोटर ब्लॉग्स सो फ्रेंड्स आई हैव बीन यूजिंग माय एडिटिंग लैपटॉप फॉर द पास्ट फोर इयर्स नाउ एंड इट्स बीन परफॉर्मिंग प्रीटी वेल टिल नाउ बट सिंस पास्ट फ्यू मंस आई हैव बीन शूटिंग ऑल माय वीडियोस इन 4K एंड इट इज नॉट एबल टू हैंडल दैट 4K फुटेज फ्रॉम द कैमरा सो आई डिसाइडेड टू अपग्रेड माय लैपटॉप एंड इंस्टॉल अ न्यू सॉलिड स्टेट ड्राइव सो इट्स अ पीसीआई एक्सप्रेस ड्राइव एंड इट कैन गो अप टू द स्पीड्स ऑफ 3 गीगाबाइट्स पर सेकंड so i'm going to install this drive in my laptop and clone the existing windows from the normal hard disk to this ssd drive so let's get started so this is my editing laptop this is msi gl627 rdx model and this is the new ssd drive so let's open this laptop so let's remove all these screws After removing this screw, you can remove the CD-ROM. So, so let's take the CD-ROM out. So, CD-ROM. Let's out the dilly. Now, let's remove the back cover. so what you can do you can use a card to now you have to remove it like this first pull this out and remove it sideways it goes like this let's keep the screw the side for a while so this is the inside view so Let's remove the drive. So this is the Samsung 970O. Let's remove the seal. So this is the M.2 slot, and your SSD goes here. So let's remove this. you let's put the cover back so the so the cover goes like this it goes from sideways so i put the back cover on and uh, before tightening any screws just make sure your ssd drive is visible so what we will do we will boot the laptop now we have to download the samsung data migration software 
so don't worry i will provide the link in the description so you can download from there and what it will do it will analyze the system drives and show you all the available drives so i have two drive installed so one is this drive hdst and the second one is the samsung 970 evo 1TB so i'll select this drive and start cloning of the c drive to the new ssd so it will take a while So I have closed all the application so that there will be no issues in the cloning. So guys cloning is about to complete. So now let's boot the device. So guys right now we are in the BIOS menu and we have to go to the boot, boot options and then so there are two boot options now first is the normal hard disk and the second one is boot option 2 which is your ssd and in the boot option 1 just click enter and select your bootable drive so now your first boot option is through your samsung ssd 970 evo just click escape and so click F10 to save all the settings. Now the system will boot from new SSD. So guys installation is complete and you can see that the windows installed in the new SSD and the total drive space is 930 GB. So that's all for this video. Hope you found this video knowledgeable. If you have any queries or doubts regarding the installation process, then feel free to drop a message in the comment section below and I will be happy to help you. Till then, take care.